Hello and thank you for watching WeatherWeb.tv. I'm Simon Keeling. The Learning Channel is brought to you in association with Weather School. And in this video, we're going to take a look at what causes a thunderstorm. For a thunderstorm to occur, we need warm, humid air. Now that warm, humid air rises and expands as it moves upwards through the atmosphere. Eventually, it'll form small, cumulus clouds. These are the fluffy clouds that we often see on a summer's morning after a fine blue sky start. Watch those clouds, and if they grow, then it's a sign that showers and thunderstorms may be on the way. Given the right atmospheric conditions, those small cumulus clouds will develop into large cumulonimbus clouds. It's cumulonimbus clouds that produce heavy showers, hail and thunderstorms. In fact, thunderstorms can only occur in cumulonimbus clouds. Inside the cumulonimbus, there's lots of turbulence. This turbulence is throwing around rain droplets and hailstones. As they bang together, they generate a static charge. With the top of the cloud becoming positively charged, and the bottom negatively charged. Eventually this charge is released back to earth. We see that process as lightning. As the lightning passes through the atmosphere it superheats it. Effectively the atmosphere explodes and we hear that explosion as thunder. We talk about thunderstorms at Weather School and you can find out more by visiting weatherschool.co.uk. Thank you for watching the Learning Channel at weatherweb.tv.